Hi, boys and girls. Welcome to Drawing Nature Part 2. So, in the last video, I asked you to get a whiteboard or a notebook. Now, you are going to help me draw a flower. It's going to look a little different than my last one. And so, we're going to draw the shapes together, and we'll see how it turns out. So this flower, it looks like it starts with a circle, just like the last one. So everyone get ready, and we're going to draw a circle. Okay, and the petals for this one look a little different than the purple one. So I think this is kind of like a curved top circle. So we're going to go up and around, up and around, and just keep going until all the petals are drawn. Now afterwards, if we looked real closely at this flower, it looks like there are lines inside. Some of them are curved, and it looks like one or two are straight, so it's up to you how you want to do it. I'm going to do a little curve that way, this way, that way. There we go. And the last part is I have to draw a stem. So it's going to be a rectangle, so it's going to go down and right back up like that. After, we're going to do the petals. So for this one, it looks like they're made of curved edges. So I'm going to try to curve it up and bring it on back. Curved and bring it. And then it looks like there are some lines. Now my leaves don't quite look like theirs, but that's okay. Every flower in every drawing is going to look a little different. Now that you've seen me draw a flower, and we have now worked through drawing a flower. I want you to now try drawing your own thing. You can draw the clouds, you can draw a moon, you could draw some trees, or you can draw the sun. Or if you really want to, you can draw anything that you see in nature. I can't wait to see how these pictures turn out.